yeah so welcome back guys uh, this is madho pvl and in today's video we are going to see the importance of uh, aict internships and uh, before knowing the importance of aict internships let us just know how to uh, apply for those internships let's get started so basically you can just click like aict internships in the google search so i'll just get the first link so after getting into the first link uh, you'll just get something like this the whole website and you can just get into the profile and already i just signed in so now uh, uh, you will get like this so click on login after clicking on the login you can just click on the student profile so after clicking on student profile you need to uh, register uh, as you are a new user so now uh, you need to just click on this uh, university details and all those stuff so i had just completed all this thing so that's the reason i am just skipping i think the there is no requirement uh, we can just directly uh, use this kl university so it's affiliated so i can just see something like this koner uh, lakshmiya educational foundation so if we just click on this it will get this and uh, you need to just confirm the details and also you need to uh, fill up on all this thing student id is nothing but the id which you which you are using in the university and also your contact number and the aadhar number and i think the mail should be only the college ones not your personal mail so after clicking on that uh, you'll just get uh, your id so let me just log in now so uh, i had just created an account uh, i think most probably um, one year back one and a half year back so let's uh, log in so after you are logged into account uh, you can just see this profile section so in the profile section uh, you will just fill these basic details in the uh, starting stage so if you just click on the edit page you can just uh, see this so you can just write about yourself i didn't write it but actually i filled everything in my linkedin page so that's why i had just given my linkedin link at the last so you need to just uh, fill up on this basic personal details and also the 10th class marks and the inter marks and all those stuff and after that uh, you need to get into this uh, kone lakshmiya i think now it is getting uh, updated uh, quickly uh, in uh, when i was applying for this uh, it didn't updated but uh, now it is uh, very fast so you can just click directly on that particular tick mark and the skills and languages are the very uh, important the most requirement uh, thing is you need to just put up on every skill which you know as far as far uh, until now i think uh, you just know most of these things uh, uh, by uh, as you came uh, to uh, i think most probably you had completed the first semester right so you need to just uh, fill up on all this um, key skills and all those things and after that uh, you, uh, if you are having any reference letter by the hod sir you need to just fill up or uh, upload this uh, reference letter don't worry even if you just upload the reference letter it will just show like no file chosen so after uh, uploading the file just leave it uh, it doesn't matter and even uh, here it uh, it is the same even after you had chosen this uh, files it will just show no file chosen but the file will be uploaded into the database of this aict internship so no worries at all and the areas of interest and all those things you need to uh, fill up on all these details and after filling all these details you need to again get back to the previous one so now uh, you will have some account so after getting an account you need to get down here and you can see this internships by edu skills so you need to just click upon this internships by edu skills and after that you can just see all these things so and so um, you need to just choose a, a particular internship which you are most interested so you can just click upon view details uh, when we are applying for the internships we used to get uh, vouchers for different global certifications and also some of the course details and all those st stuff so you can just check up on all those details and you can just click on apply now so if you are clicking apply now you need to just uh, again log in so after login you will get uh, successfully applied for the internship and if you are eligible for this internship you will just get uh, something like this so i got this uh, very recently the juniper networking virtual internship so after getting this uh, juniper networking virtual internship uh, you can uh, use this documentation link 
so after opening this documentation link you will just get an uh, um, details in which you can just access the juniper course and complete the course well after completing the course uh, i think most probably um, you will get some certificate upload link like this so you can just upload your certificate certificate in the sense as i had complete, completed this uh, juniper network course I will get a certificate from Juniper Networking, uh, 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 a certificate which defines the course completion. So after that, I am uploading that certificate in this link. So even you should do the same. So now uh, let's just talk about the importance of um, AICT internships. So AICT internships are nothing but uh, they just give some exposure, like uh, in which way the new technologies work, new technologies work. And also the way in which we can just uh, get a vouchers for uh, global certifications. We can get vouchers for global certifications and all those stuff. So and also uh, by applying for AICT internships as you can just see here. After downloading the certificate you will just get like please post your certificate on your LinkedIn profile with the following to get a better job offers. So if you just uh, tag this all people and also by uh, uh, posting with this hashtags may just increase your profile views. So all we do this is for the purpose of getting the profile views, right? So profile views are nothing but the way in which the impressions on your post sucker and then the profile views and all those stuff. So for that reason, uh, we will just uh, uh, do this AICT internships. And you can just uh, upload it here also uh, after getting that AICT internships. You can just see my certificate uh, after completing the AICT internship. So in this way, you will get a certification after completing the internship uh, with the help of AICT. So I think this made some sense. Uh, thank you for watching. Please subscribe to Works After College.